Are you ready for this? So there's a 900-year-old Maya calendar that's been perfectly predicting eclipses. So it's found in one of the oldest surviving Maya books, the Dresden Codex, it's called. And scientists just discovered something that is blowing minds. For over a century, researchers thought that the Codex's eclipse table was just an early attempt to actually track when eclipses might happen. But this new study recently published in something called Science Advances revealed something that was way more advanced. Uh, this was not just a basic chart. It was a lunar calendar system meticulously designed by Maya astrologers known as day keepers who used both observation and mathematics to predict every eclipse visible in their world. <laughs> uh, I've actually had the opportunity to visit Chichen Itza and I have to say standing there surrounded by that ancient geometry and precision, you can feel it. There's a palpable energy, a kind of energy that's hard to explain, really. It's almost like the stones themselves still remember the, the rhythm of the cosmos or something. It's, it's amazing. Anyhow, according to these findings, at the center of the system is a 405-month cycle. That's 11,960 days, and it lines up exactly with 46 turns on the Maya ritual calendar. That connection allowed them to match upcoming eclipses to specific ritual dates, meaning that they could not only predict when an eclipse would happen, but also which ceremonies it would align with. Um, this study found that this cycle helped them uh, anticipate every solar eclipse across the Maya territory for centuries. And we're talking about predictions stretching nearly 700 years into the future with no telescopes, no satellites, just sky watching, mathematics, and timekeeping so precise it rivals modern science. Think about that. I don't know. It does make you wonder. I mean, if the Maya could calculate the rhythm of the cosmos this accurately nearly a thousand years ago, what else might still be hidden in these ancient books waiting for us to discover it?